Hello, how's it going guys? Thank you for watching for this video. I'm going to do a taste test on this cookie right here. I got it on my Keto Crate box and it, the company is Nui, N-U-I, and it's a chocolate chip cookie. Mm. If you start keto and you have a sweet tooth, that's probably like the first thing you miss is chocolate or cookies or pastries. And so if you're just starting out, this is something that will probably help you stay on the keto diet. I wouldn't recommend maintaining sweets uh, throughout the diet just because it kind of prevents you from um, getting rid of cravings. Uh, but when you first starting out and you're looking for things to replace what you used to eat, then this is a good option. So I got the Keto Crate website right here and it says that this is supposed to be $3.99. It's a little bit much for two cookies, but when you're trying new snacks, when you're trying to find new things, then you know, you kind of got to pay the premium. All right, so this is being a diva again. So before we get into this cookie, I'm going to give you guys the nutritional facts. So right here, one serving is two cookies, which is one of these packages. It's 240 calories, 23 grams of fat, 20 grams of carbs. Three of them are fiber and then one gram of sugar and 13 grams of erythritol. So that's a total of four net carbs. It also has six grams of protein. It has all the little icons for gluten-free, no added sugar, no artificial sweeteners, no GMOs, low glycemic, ketogenic. Uh, so it covers everything pretty much that I'm looking for. Uh, I am excited about this one, so let's get right into it. it smells really good. I don't know if that's the plastic <laughs> or the cardboard or what, but let me pull this out. Oh, that looks nice though. Look at that. So it looks more like a butter cookie or like one of those, um, wait, what does this look like? What? Oh yeah. So it looks like a shortbread cookie. It doesn't look like a chocolate chip cookie. This one already came broken and I, just by touching it, I can tell it's a little crumbly, which you know, when you think about a chocolate chip cookie, it's usually chewy or it's kind of hard and it's not normally crumbly like this one, mm -hmm. uh, but it's good because now we can just uh, divvy them up. Vas a comer? No te quieres sentar acá? Oh. Okay, so that was a chocolate chip, but let's try the actual cookie. It is really crumbly. I do have like a little, not aftertaste, but like an after feeling. It's almost like a, like mint. It's interesting because it's crumbly, which should tell you that it's dry, but it feels a little moist. It's a weird thing to say if like, it feels moist and dry at the same time, but it's definitely crumbly. Even even the second Crunchy. cookie just kind of broke apart as soon as I touched it. Crunchy. I do like it. It's right on the borderline for overly sweet, but again, I don't really have a sweet tooth, and so maybe that has something to do with it. This side is saying it's crunchy. Mm. It's crunchy. It's good. I like it. Two cookies, two dollars per cookie. It wasn't really a big cookie, a little expensive, but once in a while it'd be nice, especially when you're craving something sweet and you're looking for something different. Uh, that whole cookie was four net carbs, so it doesn't really mess up your entire day, especially if you're already kind of in the snack for lunch, a full dinner uh, kind of eating cycle. So yeah, I recommend this one. If you don't really have a sweet tooth, you might find it a little bit too sweet. I don't know, Megu, you think it's too sweet? No? So Megu does have a sweet tooth and she thinks it's right, she thinks it's good, she liked it. And so if you have a sweet tooth, this is probably the one for you. Right now for me, I prefer something a little bit less sweet. But yeah, I think it's good. Uh, you won't be disappointed. All right, so that's it guys. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button. If you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel. I'm trying to get to a thousand subscribers and I'm really close right now. Also, if you know of any other cookie that you uh, recommend that I haven't uh, reviewed yet, let me know in the comment section below. So I really appreciate you guys watching and I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye. Bye.